Scientists may have found Planet 10. U.S. scientists have found evidence supporting the unseen Planet 10, which is much closer than the previously reported Planet 9, a planet that has not yet fully been proven to exist. The Kuiper Belt is a disk-shaped region in outer space that contains icy bodies, space rocks, and dwarf planets such as Pluto. It is understood that Kuiper Belt objects orbit the Sun with an orbital tilt, but those some 50 astronomical units away from the Sun should not. However, researchers have discovered that a group of Kuiper Belt objects located between 50 to 80 astronomical units from the Sun are tilted away from the invariable plane by 8 degrees, suggesting a large object with sufficient gravitational influence is causing this warp. Experts believe the unseen object is possibly as massive as Mars and is roughly 60 astronomical units from the Sun on an orbit tilted by 8 degrees to the average plane of known planets. Planet 10 is theoretically much closer to Earth than Planet 9, the hypothetical planet discovered in 2016. Planet 9 is predicted to be the equivalent of about 10 Earth masses and located between 500 to 700 astronomical units from the Sun. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Planets are getting discovered left and right these days. Here are some recent finds. Details emerge about the mysterious Planet 9. Although no one's actually seen the planet that supposedly lurks in the outer solar system, planetary scientists at the California Institute of Technology presented evidence for Planet 9's existence in January. As a spacecraft orbiting Saturn recently returned with even more observations that support Planet 9's existence, evidence seems to be mounting that a mystery planet truly does dwell out there. Scientists first predicted the possibility of Planet 9 after noticing dwarf planets in our solar system's Kuiper Belt had orbits that clustered toward the same direction. This strange alignment is best explained by a sizable object whose gravity tugs the dwarf planets into place. Its orbit is larger than orbits of other celestial bodies that we're more familiar with, completing a full orbit around the Sun every 20,000 years. To achieve the observed gravitational effect, Planet 9's diameter is probably around four times the size of Earth's. Its mass is approximately ten times the Earth's mass. Scientists speculate that the planet is probably an ice giant similar in composition to Neptune and Uranus. Planet 9 appears to be nearer than scientists originally thought. It could come to as close as 200 times the distance between Earth and the Sun, or 200 astronomical units. Scientists also predict that Planet 9's gravity may force additional objects in the Kuiper Belt into orbits perpendicular to its own. If the planet does prove to really exist, then we could reach it in as few as 20 years. Until then, the hunt continues for the evasive icy planet. Some scientists are now hoping to find it with the world's largest telescopes. NASA finds star system with seven Earth-like planets. NASA this week unveiled a major discovery of a star system that contains seven planets similar to Earth. What's exciting is that three of them might just be habitable enough to support extraterrestrial life. Using the Spitzer Space Telescope and Earth-based telescopes, NASA scientists have found a star system called TRAPPIST-1, located 40 light-years from Earth. The ultra-compact system contains seven Earth-like planets, with surface temperatures low enough to support water. Three of these planets are believed to be in the habitable zone, close to the system's ultra-cool dwarf star. These planets take 6, 9, and 12 days, respectively, to orbit the dwarf star. Scientists believe their Earth-like planetary compositions may not only support water, but maybe even life. NASA calculations reckon that all the newly discovered planets have a rocky surface, but the space agency says more investigation is needed to determine if any of them contain water. In 2018, NASA will launch the James Webb Space Telescope and will use this for further research into the TRAPPIST-1 system. This telescope can reportedly pinpoint water, methane, oxygen, ozone, and other elements of a planet's atmosphere. The TRAPPIST-1 system is located 235 trillion miles from our solar system, which means if you wanted to catch a flight there, the journey would take about 44 million years. So, still faster than a Spirit Airlines flight. NASA finds more planets than ever before. NASA's Kepler mission, launched in 2009 and with two more years to go, has detected 1,284 new exoplanets, including nine worlds that may be able to sustain life. 
The Kepler Space Telescope orbits the Sun, which itself is orbiting the galaxy. The telescope searches for planets that lie between two major spiral arms of our galaxy. As the telescope travels, it keeps its sensors pointed toward a particular patch in the Milky Way and has a field of view that stretches 3,000 light years from Earth. At the heart of the telescope are focal plane sensors that monitor the brightness of 100,000 stars simultaneously. Specifically, the sensors detect the decrease in brightness that occurs as planets pass in front of their stars. This is called a transit and is much like what happened on May 9, 2016, when Mercury passed between Earth and the Sun. Computer simulations then calculate how likely it is that the dip in the brightness was caused by a planet or an imposter like a star or a brown dwarf. The Kepler mission has verified 1,284 new planets. 550 appear rocky based on their size. Of these 550, nine are located just far enough from their suns to suggest they may contain water. The total number of exoplanets discovered now stands at 3,200, and a total of 21 of these may be habitable. The Kepler mission shows that with at least 70 billion stars in our galaxy, there may be billions of habitable Earth-sized planets out there that have yet to be discovered. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Scientists find three Earth-like planets circling a tiny star. The search for life beyond our solar system has taken an exciting turn after a Belgian-led team reported finding planets with the potential to host life. Astronomers using the TRAPPIST telescope in Chile have discovered three new planets in the Aquarius constellation. The planets are 40 light years away and similar in size and temperature to Earth. They orbit an ultra cool dwarf star named TRAPPIST 1, a dim red sun about a tenth the size of ours and only half as hot. All three could have liquid water on their surfaces and thus be potentially hospitable to life. The two closest planets complete an orbit in 1.5 and 2.4 Earth days, respectively. They receive two to four times more radiation than Earth and may have areas that can sustain life. The third, with an orbital period ranging from 4 to 73 days, receives less radiation and may fall within the habitable zone. Scientists are already studying the planet's atmospheric conditions using NASA's Spitzer Space Telescope, with the Hubble Space Telescope joining in soon.